single acting cylinder. On the left, we see a single acting cylinder, and its piston is returned to its start position by an external load or a spring. The oil can be supplied to the cylinder on the piston rod side or on the opposite side of the piston. In the first case, the piston is pulling and in the second, pushing. Double acting cylinder. If one strives for a movement in two directions using only hydraulic fluid, one uses double acting cylinders, which we see on the right. In a double acting cylinder of the type that the picture shows, the piston's area becomes smaller, and that's also the press force on the side where the piston rod sits. That is why the piston side is called positive, and the piston rod side is called negative. For the same reason, the speed of the piston movement becomes faster to the right in the picture.